15-year-old Carrie Ann Graham and 14-year-old Francine Marie Trimble of Forestville disappeared in mid-December 1978. Skeletal remains were found the following July in Mendocino County where they were dumped off the side of a rural highway, but they weren't identified as belonging to Graham and Trimble until 2015, thanks to DNA analysis. A high school friend said she last saw the girls on a morning in December, when all of them were smoking outside the high school. Graham and Trimble, who had been associating with classmates who used drugs, had gone to school that day, but did not attend classes. The girls told their friend that they were going to hitchhike to a party in Santa Rosa but did not say who they were meeting. The friend said someone else they knew had seen the girls hitchhiking at a Chevron gas station in Forestville. It was not clear whether this occurred on the day the girls went missing. Trimble had also told her mother she intended to do some Christmas shopping at Coddingtown Mall in Santa Rosa. Trimble's mother had seen the girls at her home sometime on December 15, 1978 and Graham's sister recalled seeing them at her parents' home either on December 15th or 16. The girls also mentioned to Graham's sister that they planned to go to a party, but she did not recall further details. Graham was recovering from surgery to remove her appendix but had left the antibiotics she was still taking behind at her home. Trimble's mother reported her missing to police within a few days when she hadn't returned home. Graham had a habit of running away to stay with friends. Her older siblings, and her parents, were not overly concerned at first, when she did not come home. They did not tell her brother that Graham was missing until they saw him in person years later. Police also did not question any of the girls' classmates, and many were not aware they were considered missing. No official missing person report was filed for Graham until decades later, when Graham's sister suspected the victims found were Graham and Trimble, and urged police to conduct DNA testing. Police had believed the girls were runaways, and had not thoroughly investigated their disappearance. Authorities could not identify a cause of death for the victims who were found in 1979, but duct tape was found at the scene likely indicating the two girls had been bound. A single bird-shaped earring was found at the scene that Graham's sister later identified as one she had given to Graham. A mate to the earring was not found at the scene. No clothing, or other items, belonging to Graham or Trimble, were found at the scene.